Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it is my opinion or no opinion at all. Scott Alicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. Give me my time. Give me, give me my time. And today we are headed to Mark Jacobs Retail to check out the brand new launch collection. The wonderful people over at Square One Mark Jacobs in Canada lovingly invited me to their launch event and I got to film everything brand new and I might be seriously in love with some of these new releases. So without further ado, let us just hop right into this Marc Jacobs shop with me trip. <laughs> Now y'all know exactly what time it is. It's time to get Percy at Mark Jacobs Retail for the latest releases. First up for the brand new bags today, we will be looking at the Zebra Hair Calf Snapshot Bag. Absolutely. Absolutely stunning. I'm loving the color block effect that they got going on the bag. It's mixed with cross grain leather and hair calf, genuine hair calf. It felt luxurious. I love the print of the zebra. Definitely something I really like. We already know I like zebra and cheetah and leopard and all of the animal prints. Unzip the bag to reveal the price tag. Price tag being $495 Canadian plus tax. All right. It's an expensive bag, but definitely worth the price if you're able to get it. Love the nickeled hardware. Like, it's like antique nickel. I really like it. And it looks bomb with my outfit which is currently paired with my orange jelly my orange snapshot jelly bag the jelly shot and the next up goes to the snapshot this one is in a color blocked leather a little cheaper four hundred and thirty dollars canadian With tax, that's probably like uh, a little under or a little over $500. And then these are brand new. This is the new Turnlock Crossbody Tote Bag. The Zebra Turnlock Crossbody Tote Bag is featured with some of the antique to nickel hardware really really beautiful the leather felt nice and it has like a beautiful bright red not too bright but a nice deep red colored lining leather so it is an all leather bag and it is a beautiful $595 for the crossbody tote. So it's just an updated tote bag made into like leather. Do you like the new tote bag or do you prefer the old tote bag? Open up the crossbody tote in regular leather. $525 Canadian. So again, not as expensive. Still expensive, but not as expensive as the Zebra. The Zebra is a little expensive. And then take a quick look at the black. The black has a beautiful yellow lining. Beautiful yellow. I 
absolutely love that pop. Like, I know you're not gonna really see that much, but that is just super nice to me. My color transfer really bad, but... Next up goes to the Zebra Canvas Medium Tote Bag. I could not find the price tag, but it is $250 American. The Marc Jacobs website uh, often switches between Canadian and American dollars for me. I don't know why. But the tote bag is absolutely stunning. The tote bag, Marc Jacobs, embroidered on the front in a beautiful oxblood color. Very stunning, very high quality canvas tote bag. And the next up goes to the sack bags. The mini sacks and the regular sack. <laughs> oh, the sack bag. I love this bag. Maybe not the zebra print one very much, but I just think it's a really fun style. I know some people really dislike it, but I think I can get down with a bag that has the sack on the front because you know me. $495 plus tax cut Canadian. the zebra leather mini sack bag all of them have the removable inner the inner pouch is removable the first generation does not have a removable pouch but all of the in-store ones here do have the removable pouch so if you do go to like the outlet or if you or are ordering online just make sure you're getting that one four hundred and thirty dollars so a fair like what $65 difference between that and the zebra love the leather lining the leather finished lining just a fun just a fun fun style and then above it is the regular the sack bag the zebra sack bag the zebra leather <laughs> not to be confused with real zebra leather do not worry about that i mean that would be really weird i don't even think they could do that but <laughs> this one has kind of like an inner flap that kind of folds out if you want it to could stuff a couple things in there including the price tag which is 730 dollars canadian so she's a bit expensive. She is a pricey girl. Really big bag. So I guess it makes sense. Still pricey. Also has the removable inner pouch. And the pouch is basically just trimmed with pebbled leather and a full canvas. Give it a twirl. Let's get a size comparison of the mini sack bag and the regular, the sack bag. A pretty large difference in size. I would definitely go for the mini because the mini suits my needs better. I don't know what the fuck I would put in the big sack bag other than my attitude. $655 Canadian for the regular. Beautiful red pebbled leather. I really like this red color. I do believe it's called True Red and obviously I do have that bag color, but I really like it. Is it True Red? Maybe it's a different color. Next up goes to the Ripped and Repair Denim, the sack bag. The Ripped and Repair Denim sack bag looks stunning. 
probably my favorite rendition of this bag besides the black trim with straw. $655. So it's not even that expensive comparatively. Like some brands really upmark those denim bags. And I feel like that's like an okay fair priced. Like it's, an, uh, it's a fair priced bag, sorry. And the denim was very nice. It was like real, real denim. And then speaking of denim... We got the denim mini bag. Has some writing on the inside. Mark Jacobs, 1984, SDNYC. And on the inner flap, it says, my other bag is the tote bag. <laughs> I love that. I actually really like that. Just kind of pop that in like your tote bag and, you know, interesting. But in today's, uh, today's world... $260 Canadian. A fair price for the bag, but what I'm trying to say is I would not leave. I I try not to in today's society with how things are in general. I try not to leave my bag unattended in a vehicle because you just never know what a crazy person will do. Even if you got nothing expensive. Let's not do that. I do sometimes, but like you gotta be careful. You gotta be really careful with that. And no, I don't leave my bag out in the open. <laughs> Next up, though, does go to the denim chain crossbody tote. Sorry, I'm like, there's so many names for these tote bags and stuff. I'm like, girl, why couldn't it just be the chain tote or something? But cute. Very different for the tote bag. Kind of gives it a more of an edge. Kind of like a biker edge to it. More punk. Less chic, if you will. But I really like it. Not something I would buy. Most definitely not. But it, it's a cute bag. I can appreciate it. The price being $390. The medium tote. Not a bad bag. And it does come in like a whole nother color way. In like this dark washed gray. I love this. This is really nice. Better than the blue in my opinion. And then I believe this would be the denim chain small tote or the crossbody. I don't know. There's one called the crossbody and there's one called the small and medium. And I'm like, I don't, at this point, I don't know which one's which, but they're all pretty. <laughs> they're all the same. They're all pretty. Unzipper. $330 for this one. So you can get $60 and go for a larger size or, you know, it, that's fair, I guess. Get a close-up of the zipper pull. Very beautiful. The construction of Marc Jacobs is never, never compromised. At least, I hope not. And then next up, goes to my new favorite from Marc Jacobs, the mini dual bag. This one was recently featured. I think they said this was on the runway. Definitely see why this is so different. I really like it. I know this is going to be a hot take, but I am absolutely obsessed with this bag. If I have not absolutely blown out my debit cards back, I would be like purchasing one of these to like secure it. But girl, oh, and it, the leather doesn't look like it's too crazy, but it smelt immaculate. $465. So it's a little expensive, but it is absolutely gorgeous. Full leather interior as well. 
ox blood. Oh, it just mm, luxury, luxury. Love the giant J Mark twist at the top with the handle. It's just so cool looking. Mark Jacobs embossed on the back. Got the pink color. And then he got the black with gold. Because, you know, brassy is classy. <laughs> I love the black, too. The black is super stunning. And they added, wait for it, the yellow. They added the yellow lining to this bag as well. We'll get a better look at that in the larger size. But for now, yes, it does have the yellow leather lining. Which is sickening. love the bag again i know it's a hot take but and i did i definitely feel like the black felt the softest of the colorways in my opinion <laughs> moving on to the large dual bag this bad girl packs a punch an absolute punch super beautiful bag minimal hardware lots of leather just give me a second there we go full yellow leather lining that to me just looks so crazy like i love it i love it it is so my style I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. You cannot convince me otherwise. 655 dollars Canadian plus tax. So again, pricey but debatably worth it. Quality immaculate. Absolutely immaculate. Other brands better take note and quick because Marc Jacobs has not come to play at all period get a quick size comparison and yeah the bag is pretty sizable in the size differences i like both of them i can't lie the big one almost reminds me of like a duffel bag and then here we got the zebra hair calf large dual bag honestly my favorite in the whole video this is my favorite i desperately wanted this bag this bag is so stunning in my opinion like i know again another hot take but stunning i love the colorway of the zebra it is different it's not like a stark white it has the ox blood soft luxe leather lining everything about this is so Herb. I'm obsessed. A little expensive though. It's $730 Canadian. I wish. I freaking wish. Hair calf felt so luxe too. It was a little longer in the hair, which I kind of like. And then we got the Zebra Mini. The Zebra Mini. Also is super stunning. I, I'm i having a hard time. <laughs> as soon as I walked into the store and seen these, I was like, I am doomed. Absolutely doomed. $525 plus tax Canadian. The Zebra Hair Calf Mini Dual Bag expensive but oh if you can get it at that price if you're able to buy it at that price i should say a 1000 percent worth it in my opinion and it looks so punk it looks so punk i love it i am gagged and then getting this size large Oh, 
looks so good with my outfit. Again, I think I might go for the smaller one if I get the chance to. But the large is so cool. That is really cool. That would be a really cool travel bag. As I stated in the beginning, this was an event that I was invited to. So there was some drinks and snacks put out. Sadly, because, you know, I have Crohn's, I could not eat it, but that's okay. And then here we got the patent leather clover shoulder bag. $330. So a fair priced handbag for Mark Jacobs. $330. In all honesty, they could be getting away with a lot higher than that. So I'm really not mad. And it does come with two different straps. A shoulder strap and then a crossbody. And multiple different leathers. Or colors, I should say. Beautiful deep red. Super stunning. Also has like a deep red lining. Fabric lining. All the fabric linings in today's video were not bad at all. Typical Marc Jacobs stuff. And the second chain strap is like half chain, half patent leather. That would be the crossbody strap, sorry. And then after that goes to the metallic leather clover shoulder bag. Another one I might keep my eye on because this one felt incredibly high-end and incredibly luxe. The leather was so soft. It was so beautifully, like, supple. $330. That, like, I feel like that's a pretty good priced bag. Especially for what you're getting from the brand. Alrighty, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's Mark Jacobs, a retail shop with me trip as this was a fun one. I really enjoyed this and the staff there is just so wonderful. So shout out to Christy and to Toby for inviting me. I really appreciate it. It was a lot of fun kicking with y'all and getting to see all of the new releases in person. But without further ado, before we hop into my outfit of the day and kitty delicious moment of the day, if you guys love handbags, hauls, luxury, Mark Jacobs, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoy this content, make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoyed today's video. And it helps with that pesky YouTube. Ow, go. Rhythm. You can also check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook, and Discord in the notification squad. And if you'd like to support me and the channel directly, you can always send me a very special super thanks donation. I love you all to the absolute moon and back, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye. A hundred people and there can be in one room. I think it was good. I don't, I don't I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's over. See you next Taco Tuesday, bitch.